Today I'm going to be putting some um, plastic mesh, deer netting, bird netting uh, around my house to catch snakes. I'm not going to say snake proof my house, but we'll see. Uh, I have used this technique uh, very successfully around my chicken yard, my chicken pen. <clears throat> I have caught oh five or six snakes in the last couple of years using it there and some of that was really un unintended. I was trying to keep my chickens in and in doing so I caught a bunch of snakes. So this is uh, something I'm going to do around the periphery of my house. What I use is um, half inch mesh bird netting. Uh, the one I buy comes in seven foot lengths and it's a hundred feet long. So I rolled it up. I use this. You can see some stuff in it. I use this to uh, uh, to cover my grapevines, keep the birds off my grapevines, but I'm going to reuse it now for this application. So I basically rolled it up. Uh, it's a, again 100 foot long. Rolled it up, cut it in half. So it's not seven feet anymore. It's three and a half feet by 100 feet long. Three and a half feet wide. Each piece is three and a half feet wide by 100 feet long. And I have two feet, two pieces. So I can do 200 feet of perimeter of my house. So uh, let me show you how I'm going to do that. Okay, so what I'm doing is just laying it out. It's three and a half feet wide, but I'm kind of curling it up, rolling it up. So it's only about maybe just a ball of, I don't know if you can see that. Just It's just kind of rolled up to where it's just, uh, it's gonna stay close to the house. Uh, one thing you need to be careful of is uh, you don't wanna mow over it. You don't wanna weed eat it. It is not gonna like a weed eater at all. It's plastic, you know. So, um, and what I'm doing also is I've fashioned me some little pins out of some wire, and I'm just putting it down, basically. I got that little piece snagging up, and it will snag on everything. Uh, got this little piece of wire. My ground is so hard. Anyway, I'll pound it down there a little bit. Uh, using that, maybe every 10, 12, 15 feet, just to keep it in place. There's no other reason for that. A snake's not going to drag it off. They're going to get caught up in it, and they're going to die. Now, what do you do with a snake when it's caught in the net? You've done this. You've caught it in that. Well, I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do. I'm comfortable, first of all, don't do anything you're not comfortable with. Uh, if you need to find somebody to come dispatch it, then fine. I will, uh, I've got a little 22 with some rat shot in it. I'll bring it out here and uh, dispatch the snake. Kind of depends on what kind of snake it is. Uh, if it's poisonous, for sure, I will. And I have seen two copperheads around this perimeter last year. So, one reason I'm doing it. Um, you're, they're gonna get they're gonna get all caught up in this and not be able to get out. That's what the trap is all about. They can't get out of that. Um, so what I've done in the past and what I would will do here 
is uh, I will, if a snake gets caught right there, I will cut it loose there after I have dispatched the snake. I'll cut it loose there, cut it loose there, throw that piece away. Um, again, if you're not comfortable doing that, make sure it's dead. If you're going to kill it, make sure it's dead. If you're going to free it, that's up. That's all up to you. Okay, just be careful whatever you do. But anyway, uh, if if you if it's been in here a day or two and you didn't notice it, it's going to be dead, and you're going to smell it before you see it probably. So. Anyway, this has been an excellent way for me to catch snakes. Uh, it was kind of an unintended, as I said before, an un unintended uh, way of doing that, but nonetheless, uh, it works. And I will show you the results when I catch one, okay? But for right now, bird netting, kind of hard to see on the ground there, bird netting up against the house or wherever you want it to be, barn, if you're having snakes in your barn, chicken pen, whatever. Um, uh, this bird netting will catch them. I will put a link to the bird netting uh, below the video. If you don't have access to some wire, uh, I think there's some, some, you can buy some landscape, landscape fabric stakes, I believe they call them, ties, something, that just basically what that is and uh, I'll try to put a link to those two objects below the video where it says show more and uh, so go down there and check it out all right that's it we're gonna catch some snakes I will give you an update when I catch one that will be part two we're gone